Good morning. Good morning. Today is Tuesday. Hello out there. Good morning. We're getting ready to sing our hello song for our mini groove and grow at home session. Let me know in the comments that you're here so I can sing hello to you in the hello song. <clears throat> Anybody guess our theme today? I did a quick post. 25 minutes ago with a with our theme for the day. I have to say, Miss Keisha makes all of our, has been making all of our graphics for these, um, for these posts. Aren't they fantastic? She's doing a lovely job. All right. Well, let's get started. All right. I'm gonna sing hello. Oops. There we go. Let's sing hello. So uh, make sure you post your hellos into the comments and I will sing to you. Hello. Hello. Let's sing hello, hello. Hello. Everyone. It's 
so nice to see you this morning. All right, so we're going to get started. Our theme today, <clears throat> if you haven't already guessed it, is um, all about our community helpers. So there are many, many people in our community that help make the world go round. And so today we're going to sing about some of those community helpers. So we're going to start things off with um, a very well-known song from Sesame Street. Can you guess what it is? It's called The People in Your Neighborhood. Do you know that song? We're going to sing it. I've got some lyrics down here. You see me looking down there, that's, I'm reading. man every day? Yeah. Oh, the postman always brings the mail through rain or snow or sleet or hail. He'll work the whole day through to get your letter safe to you. Have you sent anybody a letter? It's a great way to connect with your friends and your family. Write them a letter and put it in the mailbox. Maybe they'll write back to you. Cause a postman is a person in your neighborhood. In your neighborhood. In your neighborhood. Yes, a postman is a person in your neighborhood. A person that very helpful is, I should have laminated these cards, a fireman. Yes. Do you know someone who's a firefighter? Yeah. Oh, a fireman, it's brave, it's sad. been acting like this person all week. You guessed it, it's a baker. Let's sing about what the baker does. Well, the baker is the one who makes your bread and rolls and pies and cakes. If you want something sweet to Hi, 
Shiva. Very good. Ooh, garbage trucks. I've got a I've got a verse for that. And a policeman. Yes. I love it. Who's this? This might be mom or dad right now. What about your teacher? I love all of our teachers. All of our teachers working so hard in New Hampshire to bring us our lessons from far away. A teacher works the whole day through to teach important things to you. She'll teach you things you won't forget, like numbers and the alphabet. Cause a teacher is a person in pictures of teachers, right? Mm-hmm. All right, how about this person? Can you guess what this person's job is? So you can see, try to hold it still so it... Huh. Yeah, it's kind of blurry because my hand is shaking a little bit. This is a barber. Do you know what a barber is? Let's sing about him. Mwah, Calvin! Thank you. Oh, a barber has a great big chair. You sit in it, he cuts your hair. He'll sit and clip. The barber is a person in your neighborhood, in your neighborhood, in your neighborhood. Yes, the barber is a person in your neighborhood, the person that you meet each day. Oh, me too, Christy. Rocking this everyday side bun. What else? A worker man, says Van. That's right. The next one on my list that I had was oh, the person who drives the school bus. I don't know why these are hard, so hard to focus. If I hold it back here, maybe. If I hold them closer, it gets blurry. Bus driver. The bus driver drives fast or slow. love them. They help us keep our teeth clean. Yeah, it's right. It's a dentist. Well, a dentist cares for all your teeth. The top ones and the ones beneath. So if you have an aching tooth, he'll fix it Cause the dentist is a person in the neighborhood, in your neighborhood, in your neighborhood. Yes, the dentist is a person in the neighborhood, a person that you meet each day. Next I have, who's this? 
This one's smaller to see, but if I were to come closer and try to hold still, you can see he has a stethoscope around his neck. Who has a stethoscope around his neck? Right? A doctor. The doctor makes you well real quick. If by chance you are feeling sick, she works the whole day long to help you feel well and strong. Yeah, doctors. We have so many doctors who are doing such brave helpful work right now. Let's give a big thank you to all of our doctors and nurses and healthcare workers. We'll give them a big blick, blow them all a big kiss, go mwah. You know who's another hero in our community? Our next one. Do you know what this person does? Can you see? Yes, this is the grocer. Do you know the grocer in your community? The grocer sells the things you eat, like bread and eggs and cheese and meat. No matter what you're looking for, you can find it at the grocery store. Cause the grocer is a person in your neighborhood. I have this guy. Can you see that? There it is. Who's this guy? He's got one shoe on and one shoe off. He's got a tool. Hmm. The shoemaker is always there to take care of the shoes you wear. There's a person in your neighborhood, in your neighborhood, in your neighborhood. Yes, the shoemaker's a person in your neighborhood, a person that you meet each day. And I think, was it Calvin? Did you say our next one? He drives the big garbage truck. Oh, the trash collector works each day. He'll always take your trash away. He drives the biggest truck you've seen to keep the city streets all clean. Drivers, a person in your neighborhood, in your neighborhood, in your neighborhood. Did we forget? And the fireman's a person in your neighborhood, and the postman is a person in your neighborhood. The people that you meet.
There's so many people in our neighborhood. So many helpers in our community. All right. So, um, that's a really long song, isn't it? Have you guys seen what Baby Cooper did to my face? All right. So, one of my favorite places to get really quick little fun songs, um, that are easy to sing because they're all adapted from other melodies is a website called preschooleducation.com. Have you, have you guys ever heard of preschooleducation.com? I highly recommend it. So this is my, yeah, look, this is what they're, I know, I guess I need a do the doctor for my boo-boo, right? Um, so they have tons of really fun little songs. So right now, tell me who your favorite community worker is and I'll look them up in our little packet and I will sing a quick little song about them. I'm gonna give you a minute because sometimes our comments are delayed, but maybe I'll start with one of my favorites. Okay, <clears throat> let's start with this one. Okay, so this is a firefighter song. Okay, do you have five fingers? Can you hold up five fingers with me? Ready, let's count. One, two, three, four, five. Ooh, a nurse, okay. We'll do that next, okay? And a baker. All right, I love it. Keep them coming. Five friendly firefighters standing near the door. One washes the engines, now there are four. Can you hold up four fingers? Four friendly firefighters waiting patiently. One fixes the hoses and now there are three. Three friendly firefighters have a lot to do. One climbs up a ladder and now there are two. Two friendly firefighters exercise and run. One cooks some dinner and now there is just one. One friendly firefighter, all the work is done. This one goes to bed and now there are none. So that's really cute. All right, you said a nurse. Okay, let me find, okay, there's a nurse song right here. I think there actually were two, were there two nurse songs? Hold on. There's 15 pages of community helper songs. 15 pages. I love it. Um, I have a nurse one, but I'm just looking. Just looking in case there's one more, but I think I like this one. Okay, so this one you sing to the song Little White Duck. So it'll tell you, so it shows you the song and then in parentheses it says sung to and the melody of the song. So this one is sung to Little White Duck. So if you know that song, then you can sing along to this one. I have to sing it in my head first. All right, so for a nurse, we've got, I'm a nurse dressed in white and I feel just well when you are sick. I help to make you well, I give you shots. And if you're afraid, I'll fix you up with a big band-aid. I'm a nurse dressed in white and I feel just well. Now you're well. What else did we have? Oh, we had a baker. 
Let me see if I can find the baker. Baker, baker, baker. It is cute, isn't it? Oh, I found a farmer. We haven't, we didn't sing about a farmer in the people in your neighborhood. I might not have a baker one. Oh my gosh, and so many people. So many people said baker. Okay, what else is there? What else did you want to hear about? Of course, there isn't one for a baker in this. All right. I know. How about this one? Can you guess what this person does? How many of you have pets at home? Do you have to ever take your pet to the veterinarian? Okay, so this one is sung to Oh My Darling Clementine. So if you know that song, you can sing this one. I'm a vet, I'm a vet, I'm a veterinarian. I take care of the animals and I treat them one by one. I give shots, I set legs, and sometimes I operate. I take care of the animals cause I think they're just great. Bring your dogs, bring your cats, bring your hamsters one by one. I take care of the animals, I'm a veterinarian. Woof woof. <laughs> you have a dog, Calvin? All right, what's another one? Okay, so I bet many of you are getting some packages because maybe you're not shopping out at the stores as much and maybe you're doing some online shopping and so you're receiving some packages at home. So we might be seeing a lot of mail trucks lately to deliver your packages. So this is kind of a fun one. It's sung to the tune of Do Your Ears Hang Low. Do you drive a mail truck walk in snow and rain and muck? To deliver mail over hill and dale. Do you carry great big boxes heavy like they're filled with rocks? Do you drive a mail truck? It's cute. All right, give me another helping profession and we'll do a couple more. Coffee. All right. There should be a helper song for baristas. They certainly help me. All right, well, while I'm waiting for you to post a couple of your favorite helping positions, let's see if you can guess, we'll use this song, if you can guess one. It goes like this. What is my job? What is my job? Can, can you guess? Can you guess? I help people get well. I help people get well. Who? Am I? Who am I? Who helps people get well? Did you say a doctor? That one right here. And these people too. Forgot I had some more pictures. They drive the ambulance. 
They come and get you if you're sick, bring you to the hospital, or if they're injured. All right, here's another one. What is my job? What is my job? Can you guess? Can you guess? I fix the water pipes, fix the water pipes. Who am I? Who am I? Who fixes water pipes? You know what helping job that is? That's right, it's a plumber. Right. All right, let's see. <clears throat> I also really like this cute, this cute little one. So, um, who likes going to the dentist? This one is sung to Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Okay, ready? It's about... <laughs> Dr. Denise, Dr. Denise, the dentist, helps me keep my teeth so white. Dr. Denise, the dentist, teaches me to brush just right. Dr. Denise, the dentist, always wears a super smile. Dr. Denise, the dentist, I'll be your friend a long, long while. All right, one more. Let's do one more. Who did we? Oh, I know what we could do. This one's fun. Let's go back to our good friend, the grocer. Yeah. All right, so this one, we've got Man grocer. Oh, old man grocer has a store. Yes, sir, he does. And in that store, he has some carrots. Yes, sir, he does. With a crunch, crunch here and a crunch, crunch there. Here a crunch, there a crunch, everywhere a crunch, crunch. Old man grocer. in the grocery store. Maybe some juice. Old man gross has a store. Yes sir, he does. And in that store he has some juice. Yes sir, he does. With a gulp gulp here and a gulp gulp there. Here a gulp, there a gulp, everywhere a gulp gulp. Old man gross has a store. Yes sir, in the grocery store. Ooh, strawberries! Old man grocer has a store. Yes, indeed he does. With some strawberries, red and ripe. Oh, yes, indeed he does. Red and ripe strawberries. Red, ripe strawberries. Oh, old man grocer has a store. Popcorn. Old man gross has a store. Yes, indeed he does. And on that store, he's got some popcorn. Yes, indeed he does. With a pop, pop here and a pop, pop there. Here a pop, there a pop, everywhere a pop, pop. Old man gross has a store. Yes, indeed he does. Good one, Calvin. I like oranges. Oh, old man grocer has a store. Yes, indeed he does. And in that store has some oranges. Yes, indeed he does. They're juicy and 
and sweet, and they're orange, juicy and sweet to eat. Old man grocer has a store. Yes, sir, he does. Ooh, Milano cookies. Those are my favorites. I can't even buy them because they don't last more than five minutes. Man Grocer has a store, oh yes sir, he does, and in that store he's got Milano cookies, yes indeed he does, with a yum yum here, and a yum yum there, here a yum, there a yum, everywhere a yum yum, old Mick, uh, Man Grocer has some Milano cookies, yes sir, he does. All right, that's a cute song. So yeah, check out preschooleducation.com. So many great songs. So you can search like by category and you see you could put in. So obviously today we were doing community helpers. So I, I found so many songs about all of our wonderful community helpers. Um, for your activity today, I don't have something that I'm going to post on Instagram, but I would love to know who your biggest community helper hero is and if you want to draw me a picture of your of your favorite community helper hero um, and then send us your pictures you can either um, comment them on this video or you can send them to info at the for us to post um, but send us who your favorite helper heroes um, pictures of who your favorite helper heroes are. That was a tongue twister. So nice to see you all today. It's Tuesday. Miss Keisha has an awesome rockin' and readin' session planned. Have you guys checked out rockin' and readin' yet? We've got our bedtime stories and relaxation tonight. Let me know in the comments if you are still here. totally say bye is for those of you who have older kiddos um, we have a um, we're doing a teen music production workshop this um, we started we started it last week and we're doing it again this week it's um, on Thursdays and if you go to if you're on our Facebook page and you just go over to events you'll see it's got a green photo and so it's really fun it's it's free um, so register you do have to register for it though because um basically we're doing it through our google meet so you it, once you register you'll get an invitation to join the meet on thursday um so for all of you older all of you friends out there with older siblings join our teen music production workshop um lots of fun on thursday all right we'll see you later